What up, what up, what up? Joker1014. How's everybody doing tonight? <clears throat> Me and the woman sitting around a little campfire. There it is. The fire. Yay, yay. Cold. Alright, I'm going in the garage. Love, Love it. you. Oh, let's go in here where there's light. Let there be light. What's up everybody? How's everybody doing on this beautiful, beautiful day? Actually a beautiful night. It's uh, October. Didn't know if anybody's going to any haunted houses. I think next weekend I might take the woman to a haunted house. I don't know yet. Deep pens. We don't go to those places very much. I like to go to a, it's called a haunted a formatory. It's a, it's a, a prison. It's haunted up north and uh, north of where I live and uh, it's pretty scary I heard and there's another one down south of where I live that is um, pretty good too and I guess they can actually touch you and they can throw you out some windows and if you make it through you get your money back plus a hundred bucks so I don't like to be touched. I don't want to be thrown out a window. And it's like a three-story building. They can throw you out a window and you land on a... Like one of those big air things. But anyways, if anybody's going to any haunted houses this month, leave it in a comment down below. I want to hear everybody's uh, experience. And I like to read everybody's comments on haunted houses if you guys like to go. Some haunted houses have a lot of clowns, and she don't she don't like clowns, so uh, that's one thing she don't like, and uh, that's why we don't go to too too many haunted houses because there's some haunted houses have a lot of clowns, so we we try not to go. But I like to hear your guys' experience of haunted houses, or if your guys are going to one, uh, tell me the name of the haunted house where it's located, what state you're in, and uh, I'm in Ohio, so we have quite a few haunted houses here in Ohio. Um, if anybody makes a trip to Ohio, I would look at the, uh, it's called the Haunted Prison. It's the haunted, it's the old prison up north. Uh, I think the town, the city's called Mansfield, I think. Uh, it's called Mansfield. Um, it is uh, up by Cleveland area, or kind of by Cleveland, Ashland area, I think. And uh, if you ever come to Ohio, go check it out. It's pretty cool. They do tours throughout the summer, and they also do uh, haunted houses uh, in the fall, around October. Uh, it goes clear up until like December or November 1st. Either November 1st or first week of November, they, they stay open for the haunted house. So, um, I might do a Halloween video here soon. I uh, have a couple ideas doing a Halloween video, so I might dress up and show my costume. Even though I already have my costume on and uh, I'll... Can never take the mask off for some one reason <laughs> i can never take the mask off but anyways i just want to see say hi to everybody say thank you to all my subscribers and all the new subscribers if you're new to the channel i noticed there's a couple new people it just subscribe to the channel today if you're new we talk about everything we talk about my daily life we talk about my recovery we talk about cars as you can tell behind me we're still working on the kia um we're just waiting on some parts to get here so i can put the new rocker panels and uh the fuel tank in so we can get it out and then i gotta order a top for it because if you look it's got a soft top 
there's a soft top it goes on top so I'm getting ready to order a new top as well um, if anybody has any questions about the channel feel free to ask like I said we talk about everything and anything we talk about my daily life we talk about recovery we talk about saving people we talk about uh, people who's going through addiction and who are going through recovery it is a pain in the ass to go through recovery it's a pain every day you wake up in pain uh, you wake up miserable because you're pretty much restarting your life when you're going through recovery <clears throat> um, tomorrow I will be doing a video on rescuing animals and how you should treat an animal there's a lot of people in my hometown that don't like to treat animals real well so I will do a video on that too um, pretty much we're not doing too much tonight we're just chilling hanging out around the campfire uh, just having I think she had a couple people come over. I had my cousin over earlier today. Ryan, if you're watching this, what's up, bro? Thank you for stopping. And just remember, if you are watching this, dude, we're definitely going to have to get you on camera so we can do some good videos. So I want to give a shout out to my cousin, Ryan. What's up? And uh, thank you for stopping. It was, had a good time today. That was, that took a lot off my mind. Um, and Chris, if you're watching this, bro, you're more than welcome to stop over anytime you want, man. You know where I'm at? Just hit me up, stop over. I know you said you'd be over in, earlier and uh, I still haven't seen you, but that's all right. Busy people, you're off this weekend, so you got to do stuff with the family. Understand. So don't apologize or anything like that. You're good. You're good. Because <clears throat> I guarantee you're going to text me tomorrow and say, Hey, man, I'm sorry I didn't show up. You're good. If you're watching this too, Chris, you're good. But with that being said, I, like I said, I just wanted to hop on here to wish everybody, a, a, or not wish, but say happy weekend. Um, I'm having a good time this weekend. I'm chipper i'm happy i'm not letting letting people get to me today uh, i'm doing real good uh like i said back to uh the new subscribers we talk about everything on this channel if you got something you want to discuss leave it in the comments we will discuss it if you want to know something about me and my recovery or something about me just leave it in the comments uh, if you watch most of my videos, I do live in Ohio. It is cold here right now. Uh, we're getting into the winter months. Uh, well, it's, I do have kids. I, I have a family. And uh, I work 12-hour shifts. And uh, I work in my garage on the weekends. And, uh, and I do YouTube. Um, hopefully that answers some of your guys' questions. But with that being said, I think I'm going to get off here so I can get back out to the fire. And uh, go inside and find something neat. Uh, tomorrow, I am. I might even do it tonight. I don't know yet. But we're going to talk about how to treat animals. Um, it seems like it's going around a lot. A lot of people... Um, not respecting animals, not doing too much with animals. So, uh, we will discuss about that because I got a story to tell you guys. And, uh, it was very hard yesterday for me to do what I did. Um, I don't like doing it. I don't like taking the animals to shelters. But, but it had to be done. Because the poor guy was starving. It was in a, in a bad, bad environment. And I went down. I rescued it. And I took it somewhere where it could get fed. And taken good care of. So, 
I will discuss more about that situation tomorrow or maybe tonight. <clears throat> so if you guys have any questions, just let me know. If you guys have any experience or been in through an experience with animals that you rescued or recovered, tell me your story and I will touch base on it. With that being said, Joker 1014 is out. Much love. Always stay true to yourself. Stay positive and don't let anybody bring you down. And if you're going through recovery, keep it up. Everybody who is going re through recovery, you're not doing it alone. I'm with you on it. I'm going through it myself. And we can get through this together. And women, I'm talking to the women. You all are beautiful. Just remember that. It don't matter what you look like. You guys are all beautiful. And you guys got a big heart. Remember that. And don't let anybody tell you different. With that being said, Joker is out. See you guys in the next video. Much love. Stay true. Stay positive. See you later.